Meteorologist Joe Hansel here with your latest update on your national forecast. And thanks so much for tuning in here. So, of course, uh, for our national update here, I want to start, start off things away from the lower 48 out in the tropics, obviously, as we're still watching Lee, Category 2 storm with winds at 100 miles per hour. But still, Maria continues to weaken, kind of showing well on the visible satellite as the clouds are stretching away. That spin, not quite as compact as before yesterday. In fact, winds continue to lighten up 70 miles per hour as of the 11 o'clock in the morning update for this Thursday. Movement is starting to accelerate east at 13 miles per hour, but again, that wind at 70 miles per hour makes it a tropical storm as that forecast from the NHC continues to kick it out to sea throughout the weekend into early next week. Now, a cold trough of low pressure for the lower 48. That's going to work in areas of the Great Lakes region, New England. Chilly air returning for us this weekend out there. Elsewhere, a big ridge of high pressure will try to keep things quiet across the nation today as uh, there's really not a whole lot of stuff across the nation going on in terms of watches, warnings, and advisories. Still high surf advisories, though, on the coast of Maine, near Cape Cod, southern Rhode Island as there's still some rough waves associated with Maria today, but also southern Texas. A flash flood watch remains into effect as some moisture works in from the south. In terms of severe weather, not expecting that across the nation. Just a few areas of some generic thunderstorms possible today, fr Friday as well. But as we get into Saturday, there's a marginal risk of severe weather east of Denver, portions of southwestern Nebraska as well, as some rather, en uh, rather energetic energy shoots east of the Rockies. So for your Thursday afternoon, again, some heavy rain certainly possible in the southern Great Plains, east of the Rocky Mountains region, especially in southern Texas near the Mexican border, where there is that flash flood watch still in effect for much of Thursday. Otherwise, we're expecting some cool conditions still out west. Cities like Denver, 55 today. Seattle, plenty of sunshine. You're at 83. Out east, uh, Charlotte still, well, baking in the heat a little bit. Hot topping out right near 92.